Uh, let's go straight across live to Vasanti, who's in Mysore with the police commissioner Sunil Agarwal. Vasanti, is it uh, peaceful now or is it still tense? Well, Dr. Roy, the tension is quite palpable in the area that I'm standing. Of course, there is heavy police presence. If I can just show you, there have been additional forces that have been requisitioned, the Rapid Action Force, besides the State Reserve Police Force, and also the City Armed Reserve uh, Police. But uh, for more on this, let's go across to the man himself, the Police Commissioner, Mr. Suri Agarwal. Thank you so much for joining us with all your hectic meetings. But Mr. Agarwal, what are you going to do so that the incidents that have happened this morning will not repeat in Udaigiri? This, uh, the incidents which has taken place today, uh, it's a very, very unfortunate incident which has happened. Mysore city uh, has been known uh, to be a very, very peaceful place. It's, it's, uh, it's a city having global importance from the tourism point of view. Uh, action has been taken immediately. Uh, situation was very bad in the morning uh, with uh, thousands of people um, uh, roaming around in the streets trying to take law into their hands. Uh, uh, so, but uh, if I may interrupt you here, uh, Junaid Pasha, now there are conflicting reports on, on his death, how the 14-year-old boy died. Uh, some say that it's police firing, so what, is, what would you say? Uh, we had um, uh, to disperse a large, uh, uh, large number of people who were gathered in, at various localities of Udaygiri. So force was used, we had used uh, lathis, we had used tear gas extensively, however uh, at one place Firing in the air was done, so initially the report which we were getting that one death has taken place is due to police firing, so we were having a doubt that maybe it's a ricochet injury because a direct, direct firing was not done. This is, I have confirmed and I am confirming again. However, uh, the post-mortem is being held uh, at, the, at the, uh, the bodies have been shifted to the mortuary and we have put a team of doctors. We, a committee is examining and the the preliminary reports confirm that it is a stab injury and not a bullet injury. Well, this area, Udaigiri particularly, has a really long history uh, since 1992. So, I mean, right now, the latest steps uh, you think will ensure peace? Yes, we, have, we are taking both the communities uh, into confidence. Just now, about half an hour back, we had a right. peace committee meeting uh, at the Corporation uh, uh, Council right. Hall along with the Deputy Commissioner, Mr. Manivannan. We had appealed to both the communities who have promised all their support to see that uh, Udaygiri does not witness such type of right. things. Thank again. you. Thank you so much, sir. Reassuring words from the top cop of uh, Mysore city, the city of palaces. With that, it's back to you, Dr. Roy. Thanks, Vasanti. Thank you very much.